Ovulation induction, uh, the term means to induce or to start ovulation. Now there are two ways that we do ovulation induction. Number one is in the women that have no menstrual periods or irregular periods, so they're not ovulating. So it makes sense to induce ovulation. The second group is in the women who already ovulate, but our goal is not to make them ovulate properly, they may already be ovulating, but to make them ovulate more than one egg. Now the advantage of that is that if we make two eggs every month and our fallopian tubes don't work very well, we have two chances that the ends or the fimbria of the fallopian tube would actually pick the egg up. If the sperm are not working well, the sperm have two targets to try to get in. So with ovulation induction, we can either take someone who's not ovulating at all and make them ovulate, or we can take someone who's ovulating one egg every month, which is what happens 99% of the time, and get them to make two eggs, three eggs, 10 eggs, however many we want based on what we're trying to accomplish.